but we're gonna walkthrough doesn't the hints in the walkthrough didn't end if I accept so I'm gonna say no JK as if a creep like you you're acting real weird what does this crap you're spouting don't tell me that just like you to come here no don't come near me you're such a stupid girl uh oh He's got the battle axe! Why can't we have it? I told you to come here. I won't have a woman talking back to me. Stay Damn. away! You can't run, but you can't hide. Here's Johnny! And Griffin, stop being so damn full of yourself! By your side? You're a flat out creep! Let's leave with Mr. Gray here. Certainly ain't me! Hear me? Don't you even try anything stupid like this again! <laughs> well, that's different from normal horror game protagonist. Seitaro? Hey, you Seitaro! Just kick the shit out of him. What are you like? Ah, crap. He's passed out. Well, if you came at me with, with an axe, I'd kick the shit out of you too. <laughs> Sitaro! Ow, my stomach. What the hell did you. Gosh! Kicked him again! What the hell, Ramazaki? Shut up, Baldy. I'm the one with the hell, and don't go attack me out of the blue, you goddamn pervert! Wh who go after a monkey like you? What? You say I'm lying? No, hold on. The headache kept getting worse, and I couldn't think. Then I was. An axe. Yeah, I was carrying this, and I. You. You, <laughs> you remember? You were conscious when you were chasing me? Yeah, I was, but I couldn't stop what I was doing. Body was moving on its own. It's the mermaid. Her curse skewed you up. Screwed you up. <laughs> Shut up! I can't think straight. I've been talking this whole time. Same as it did, Utah. You're da! You're still going on with this? There's no damn curse. Oh, really? <laughs> you naive bastard. Oh, really? Ain't no curse, huh? Then why are you saying you attack- And you're saying you attack me sane? Hug me sane? Said come here stuff sane? Uh, well... Said you were scared, wanted to bring it at your side, and I was in your- Oh, that was in your right mind? Cause that means you- STOP! Alright. It's a curse. <laughs> I'd never be attracted to a bumpkin like you. Hell, even with a curse, I wouldn't believe it. For Christ's sakes, that's his reason? Yes. I sure don't believe in curses, but given Yuka and Yuta, there's a chance it's true. That's what I've been trying to say! It's all the fault of the curse! I've gotta do something about it to get out of here. I have a plan for what doing something entails? Hell no! So we gotta look for a lead! Alright, I'll help. Maybe I'll read on, up on that mermaid legend. There might be some books about it. I'll check on it in the study. You look around the mansion in the swamp. You can swamp come ask me about anything. Alright, I got it. Swamp people. Axe Satara was holding. I don't get to keep it? <laughs> Man, it sucks. Get to keep everything except the axe. <sighs> Look at that piece of paper you had earlier, that weird map you had earlier. Maybe he... Well, I'm gonna talk to him about it. The map. He said, Taro, you got a compass or something? Eh? Why? I found this dirty old map. I want to go with this red mark, but I don't know the directions. I see. Here, borrow this. See, so Taro's with Toy Swatch. A watch? What the hell for? Hold it level and point the hour hand towards the sun. Hold it in the middle of 12 and the hour hand indicates the sun. Right in the middle of the... Right in the middle of 12 and the hour hand indicates south. Words! Oh, I gotcha. Thank. Anything else I can talk about? Uh, the button. Found this in the fish tank. Know what it is? A plastic button? Maybe it's for some machine? Told you. Actually, there's a boat outside. Maybe it's a start button for that. Huh? What you think? Probably sure, but it did seem to be missing a button. 
Anything else? The boiler room. I went in the boiler room and I found this generator thing. The power generator? Why is that in a boiler room? Hell if I know. There's a water heater and plumbing and all this other mess. I what, what, wonder what all that's for. Plumbing? Well, that's curious. I'll have to check that later. And we'll ask about the swamp. Sitaro. About this mermaid legend, what do you think? You figure anything about it? What's this all of a sudden? Hey, you got a good head if nothing else. I guess figured we might have made something of it. Getting more of my nerves by the minute. A mermaid legend, huh? Well, it's weird. A mermaid here in the mountains? And there's a lot of weird bits to it. Weird bits? Legends like this are usually made either to bring people in or to keep people away. Like couples who come to this lake stay together forever. Kappa live in this river, so stay away. Oh, no, Greeks, Greek fraternities live in the river. No! no! The former brings people to lie or repels them. As a mermaid legend, clearly it's a keeper away. Talking about a curse tells you it's dangerous. Yeah, and what about all that? Where do they keep people away from? Eh? People wouldn't come here in the first place. It's a village, but not many people. Why a legend that keeps people away? Really don't want them swimming in the swamp? And why make an elaborate story about a man stealing a mermaid and getting cursed? It's just saying Kappa would do fine. And then there's even more that's, even more that's off. Like what? Let's just say it's part of the mermaid's curse that girls vanish from the village. Why would girls vanish? If the mermaid had a grudge, wouldn't it be against the man, man, men of this family, the Suchitas? Why the unrelated village girls? You got a point. Like a bunch of them. It's clearly been fabricated for something. What could such an utterly fake legend be for? That's what I want to know. I want to know that, too. I want to know, can you show me? Yes. I want to know about these strangers like me. Oh, who sings that song? Phil Collins. Phil Collins. It's from Tarzan. We got the red button, gonna put it on the boat. I think. Use the button on the boat. I'll try. You don't want me to use it. Go to the other side of the boat and try. I... Meh. Nope. Bastards. No chance. Not letting me. No dice. No, no. Apparent map of the swamp. Use the clock to check directions. Let's go to the front of the swamp. Uh, okay. I'll try. Maybe this is it? I don't understand what it says. Where am I? Faces of the sun, hour hands here, and south of twelve in the hour hand. Alright, so the old man old man is the south. The mark on the mark is east, so it means something's across the swamp would take forever to go around. Is there anything else I could do? Yes! Now use the button on the boat. We're gonna use the friggin' boat! Ha! Insert the red button. We're gonna go across the swamp, yeah. Oh, she pulled it by herself. I'll start the engine and get to the other side. Rin! Say, Tara, what? You want to spot on the map? I'm coming with you. Don't want you taking a dive again. Ah, shut up! I'm on a boat and... Woo! <laughs> no, 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 no. Don't mention that awful movie. <laughs> as a kid, I loved that movie, but now I it's realize... Dana Carvey. I know. I loved that movie as a kid, but now I realize how ridiculously dumb it was. Rocks. Can we use Rock Smash? Rock Smash. And there's our log. No, 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 no. Next by a brown mark. What's it marking? This thing? Ground here is weird. It makes a weird sound when you step on it. Dig up the ground! We have a spatula? Oh, great. Looks like you can remove it. I need something. I see something below. Looks like there's a ladder going down. And off we go! Whee! Hey, Ren, where's that lantern I gave you? Oh, I broke it a while back. Well, screw you, too. 
you hold that and follow me, all right? It's amazing he can see without that lantern. What's up? It's so cold all of a sudden. I'm freezing. That should help. Let's go. Yeah, thanks. Dynamite. Dynamite. Doesn't look locked. Let's go in. Monster? Dun, 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 dun. No! That's a corpse. A woman's corpse. A corpse? You're right, not something that huge and gross. Wouldn't a corpse be rotten? It's not just a corpse. It's preserved with adioprasir. I don't know. Words. S say again? Non decaying corpse kept away from air and germs. The body hardens up and won't fall apart. Now I know what that legend is all about. Wait, really? Why don't we believe in the legend? Because mermaids don't exist. That's right, there's no such thing as a mermaid, so we won't believe in a mermaid legend. What if it isn't a mermaid? Huh? What if it isn't a, mer wasn't a mermaid, but just a regular woman? A man from the mountains finds a beautiful girl on the beach. Maybe a diver, maybe just swimming along. A man falls for her and abducts her to his home. He loves seeing her in the water, so he has her live in a fish tank. Always living in water makes the girl sick. And she dies. And even when her body freezes, she's not allowed out of the water. So that's how these corpses were made. But wait, why leave the corpse like that? And why the Addy thing? And why are there five of them? He loves the corpse, corpse in water for a month, and it'll be falling apart by then. It's hard to get right circumstances for preservation. But these corpses are barely damaged at all. They purposefully observed right as they started swelling. Like, purposefully? You found those old documents, right? About medicine to stop germs from spreading. What, was it, what if it was to preserve these corpses? Oh. The man loved her, even blow and ugly like this. In fact, perhaps this is what he loved most. It's creepy. Love these corpses? Some strange people out there. Strange preferences. No one else might ever know them, of course. Perhaps he couldn't get with the girl after she died. He couldn't watch her rot, so he went to a la last resort. But that eventually became his goal. What do you mean? Their memory's curse takes village girls. He couldn't have just one. The pipes in this room must go to the boiler room. He must set them up and continuously fill fish tanks with that germicide. These women are Ophelia's to the Suchita men. They adore sight of a woman drowning in the water. So much that they drown them themselves. It's crazy! These women were abducted for that? Yes. This is the truth of the mermaid, but I don't understand. Why let that secret be known via a legend? Why create a legend to expose it all? The women! The Suchita women! Wouldn't the Suchita women know that their male relatives were off stealing girls? They loathed them but couldn't stop it. They were frightened of being made mermaids themselves. So they made the legend to keep people away. So at least no outsiders would fall victim. I see. That seems to explain the whole legend. But it doesn't seem to help us much. We don't know how to help Yuka or get out of here. Let's go, Rin. It seems finding a map and getting out of here comes first. Dun, dun. Huh? Stop it. I don't know where you came from. I can't take you back. Leave us alone already. Take me back to the earth. To the earth. To the earth? 
Bury him, bitch. That's right. You're not mermaids, just normal women. You don't like looking so hideous. I'll do what I can. Mm. A pickaxe. Take it. What kind of machine? Can I? Can't I break it with a golf club? Let's do that. Um, we'll be right back. Be 